to cheat a little bit. Make up for the fact that we don't have an interference with it. We need to flow a little bit of metal out from this. That's the way we're going to do it. We're just going to use a punch. And when the point goes in, the material has to go somewhere so it flows out. Right. We're going to do that on all six sides. So I'm over like 11,000, so that should be about a, about right. When yeah, so this, you know, we're hoping that the amount we flow out is at least 11,000. If it is, then this trick will work. If it didn't flow enough out, then it'll, it'll be loose. In any case, I'm afraid you have a pencil cup instead of a shot glass, because it won't be watertight. <laughs> yeah, that's... <laughs> that's okay. You know what? I wouldn't want to drink out of no, uh, particular aluminum anyway, so... So this is the trick we're going to employ. Make it all fit. Alright, now... small problem here. The dimple? You feel that? Yeah. It's no big deal. It just means your, your cup's going to rock. Do you yeah, want to take an opportunity to clean that up or do you want to live with that? Ah, what? With back, in, back in the chuck? Try and come across with the spring cut or what? No, or a, a, file a regular it? cut. Nah, file will mess up the rest yeah, of the right. finish. I did it again with the lathe if you want. You were a little bit, uh, or just a little high with your tool. I can tell by the shape of the right, right. It's up to you. Or you can always lap it with a piece of sandpaper. Yeah, there. on a piece of glass and some nice paper, sandpaper. I'll do that. All right. All right. So, now, I can tell already and that's going to work fine because I can't put them cool. together. I can't put them together by hand. So we float enough material for that to work. So the trick is just holding these two square to each other until we can get the vise on it. And then, go ahead. Once it's, once it's shut, don't um, don't keep pressing because you'll deform it. Just go in until it's nice and tight, and then turn it two ha uh, two flats and do it again just to make sure it's even all the way around. Beautiful. All right, so loosen it up, turn it two flats, and do it again. Two flats. Yep. So just rotate this two flats, and then you'll hit it with the vise again. So let's rotate it one two flats and hit it again. Gentle push, very good. And then two more. Okay. So it's all nice and square. Exactly. There you go. That's all there is to it. Oh, sweet. Nicely done. Who says you need an arbor press? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, you'd mess it up with an arbor press. Just because the uh, the ram on an arbor press isn't big enough. Perfect. There you go. Very nice. Sweet. Nicely done. Thank you, sir. There you go. All right. Yeah.